Hello, it's the 25th of May, and on the 25th of each month, there is an announcement on, on rangernation.com about the 25th anniversary of Power Rangers, and so let's check it out, see what the announcements are for today. So we go to 25 for the 25th, and we're going to start at announcement number 8, and that will be the first announcement for today and it is a power rangers premium collectible series red ranger statue and i'll go ahead and read xm studios is exciting ex excited to present our first power rangers premium collectible series statue the iconic team leader of the mighty Morphin power rangers the red rangers is immortalized in amazing detail in this one-fourth scale cold cast porcelain each handcrafted statue is individually hand-painted with the highest possible quality finish. Best of all, you can power up with the Dragon Shield and Dragon Dagger. Go, go, Power Rangers. And so this is a very expensive statue. I can't quite remember the price off the top of my head, but it's, uh, I'd say it's above my price level, what I'd be willing to pay for a Red Ranger statue. But it looks very nice. And you can see it's got interchangeable parts, so you can have him as plain Red Ranger with a blaster and sword, or you can have him with the Dragon Dagger and Dragon Shield. Um, if you're in the market for a Red Ranger statue, this looks amazing. So if, if you want it and you can afford it, more power to you. All right, and so number nine would be the next announcement, and that is the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the Complete Series, 25th Anniversary Edition Steelbook. And so that says, In celebration of the 25th anniversary of the multi-generational pop culture phenomenon, Shout Factory, in collaboration with Savannah Brands, is proud to announce a stunning Power Rangers collection. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the Complete Series, 25th Anniversary Edition Steelbook, Spanning the first three seasons of the Power Rangers television series and spotlighting Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the movie, for the first time on Blu-ray, this home entertainment collection features over 60 hours of action-packed entertainment across 19 DVDs and one Blu-ray, including hours of bonus content with brand new interviews specific to the movie. Sorry, I got a little lost in there. That's long, but... Um, this is a nice set. It's it, it's pretty expensive. Um, and what I'll say is if you're on a budget, if you're looking uh, not necessarily to pay top dollar, um, this is a set that's been released in previous years with most of these bonus features. So if you're not interested in the Blu-ray of the movie or having, you know, the exact, uh, you know, steel book, uh, 25th anniversary covers and stuff like that. Uh, you can look on like Amazon or eBay or other re retailers and get, find uh, cheaper collections of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. They'll have most of these bonus features. So, but if you are looking for the 25th anniversary edition of this and, you know, you can afford it, go for it. Th this is a very, very nice looking collection. I mean, it. you can just look at, you know, the DVD packages. It's just gorgeous. All right. And last announcement for today. Number 10. Legacy Wars Power Rangers X Street Fighter. Or is that Time Street Fighter? I've never figured out how to quite read that. But anyway, so what it says is the Shink... Oh boy, the Shinku Hadoken. I hope I said that right. Histomorphin Grid. Uh, two of our most beloved franchises collide in Power Rangers Legacy Wars. With this month's major updates, players can now add Street Fighter characters such as Ryu, Chun Li, Ga Gal, Akuma, M. Bison, and Kami to their robust existing lineups of Rangers and villains. Already one of the most popular fighting games on mobile. With over 40 million installs, Power Rangers Legacy Wars is available for downtown, uh, for download now on the App Store, Google Play, and the Amazon App Store. Um, so this has uh, been going on in Legacy Wars for I think maybe a week or something is when it was first announced. 
I haven't seen all these characters in there, so there's probably some that need to drop. Um, I know Ryu is definitely in there. Um, I think I think Chun Li th and uh, seems like seems like I, there's three characters right now. Don't quote me on that. I'm going off memory. I know for sure Ryu because he's like you know by Ryu you know um, in the app right now. So Legacy Wars is a tremendously popular app. It's very successful. And I think this partnership, uh, Street Fighter also has an anniversary going on. So obviously they're trying to promote themselves too. They've got a, a collection coming out on the consoles. But um, this really does speak to the success of Legacy Wars that Capcom would go to Power Rangers Legacy Wars with a partnership like this. And um, I definitely recommend if you're interested in the Street Fighter characters, probably get them as soon as you can if you're interested and willing to pay the money to buy them because unfortunately you probably will have to pay to play for those guys. Um, but because anytime you have a licensing deal, um, those characters could go at any time. But if you buy them or unlock them, then they're yours and as long as that app lasts. And obviously a lot of things are up in the air with Hasbro buying the brand, but uh, Legacy Wars as an app, since it's so successful, I would imagine that um, it should st stick around if, if there's one app that Hasbro is going to keep around, I would imagine it would be Legacy Wars. So that's kind of a neat crossover. Um, and just uh, updates on a couple of previous items. Let's see. I was trying to find. Let's see here. Yeah, the gold staff. Um, the legacy items, the last wave of legacy items, like the Green Ranger helmet, the gold, Golden Power Staff, and the Zeonizer. Um, I, I was a little like, where are you going to get them? Toys R Us is, is uh, you know, closing down. Um so you can pre-order them online. There's apparently another shipment of them coming. Uh, so like Big Bad Toy Store or someplace like that, you can pre-order them right now and get them for a decent price. And there was also, let's see, where was the, ah, the figures. So that's another thing that I was want, like, when is this going to drop? They're not in stores now. Um, soon is what I what I'm gathering. They are released in Australia, this current wave. It's got Psycho Blue, Psycho Red, and Dino Thunder White. Now, Psycho Black, which is pictured here, uh, my understanding is he was not planned for this, this particular wave, which was always solicited to drop in mid-year, which is right about now. Um, he was actually for the next wave, which would be a little later in 2018. So it's not too surprising he's not there. Um, I think there was also a planned pink Psycho Ranger that was supposed to be a part of this wave. Unknown what's going to happen to her. But, I mean, in theory, we should be seeing them in the States pretty soon if they've already dropped in Australia. Keep your fingers crossed and your eyes peeled. So that's it. That is the uh, announcements uh, for this uh, month for the Power Rangers anniversary. Um, not bad. Uh, pretty decent stuff. Um, we'll be seeing what, what uh, other stuff drops. Uh, there's supposed to be a promotion with Burger King coming up. Uh, that may be August or or I um, it could also be next month but I suspect it could be closer to the anniversary date it's going to be uh Mighty Morphin Power Ranger toys at Burger King so uh and then of course there's also other stuff that they've got going on so hopefully uh we'll have a lot of other announcements and things will keep coming uh this year even with the transition to Hasbro all of Saban's plans are still un rolling out and hopefully any agreements that Saban made are going to roll over to Hasbro and there will be no interruptions in the 25th anniversary. All right, guys. So that's all I got. Uh, like and subscribe for more videos. And until the next time, may the power protect you.